Yo, what's poppin'? What's good, man? It's Jamal Wade, and I'm back with another video. And in today's video, we going over Kendall Jenner confirms why she let go of Devin Brooker. You know, I know my subscribers been, you know, reaching out to me, letting me know what's going on, you know, what they what they think I should uh, record to and decided to do this video today. We're going to get into this video. Y'all be sure to smash that like button, comment, subscribe, turn on post notification because we on our way to 10K. We're going to get there. I appreciate everybody that's rocking with me. Let's go. Have Kendall Jenner and Devin Booker been lying about the real reason why they broke up? I still have a lot I need to figure out before I can like welcome a child into my life. Like I'm still like just enjoying life on my own and I'm okay with that right now. Okay, was Kendall being pressured into a life she wasn't ready for? Did the breakup have anything to do with Devin's cheating allegations? Or did it have anything to do with Kendall's sexuality? We have all the messy details. So Kendall and Devin tried to keep their relationship under wraps for a while, but with time, they got more open about their feelings. What's happening with you and Devin Booker? Um, he's my boyfriend. You're together. Yeah. At some point, Kendall even admitted that she wouldn't miss any of Devin's games for anything. Of course, I, I watch every game unless I have. Yo, hey, so I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I didn't even know they was dating. Like, I don't know. You know, I personally didn't know that they was dating. Maybe y'all knew they was dating. I didn't even know they was dating. But, you know, it seemed like she going through that young woman phase where young women want to be single. They want to, you know, live their life. And they feel like they got, you know, more options out there. I'm not saying that that's the case. But it could be the case with her saying that she want to break up. What do y'all think it is? You know, do y'all think that she just want to be single? Or she just don't want to be with him? She a Kardashian. I ain't saying nothing bad. I'm just saying, like, what do y'all think she, you know, really want? Y'all leave a comment. Let me know what y'all thinking. Uh, last night I had a dinner, but all my friends and family know that I, like, sit with my phone where, wherever I am. Like, well, just like many of the Car Jenner relationships, that one, too, came to an end. Kendall and Devin actually first broke up in June 2022, with sources reporting that Kendall believed that their vision for the future was no longer aligned. Then it was reported that they broke up again in November 2022. But... See, I ain't even know all this, but that's the point. You know what I'm saying? As a celebrity or as a, you know, an athlete or whatnot, you really don't want to put your relationship out there unless that's what you want people to know you for as far as like, yeah, I'm with this person. But I can understand why it was that way. The actual breakup apparently happened in October. The official reason, according to a source that spoke to people, was that Kendall and Devin were very occupied by their occupations and endeavors. The source said both have incredibly busy schedules right now with their careers, and they've decided to make that a priority. Another source confirmed a split to Entertainment Tonight, saying Kendall and Devin broke up last month. They are both still young and extremely busy in their careers. It was becoming difficult for them to prioritize their relationship with their schedules. This so see, right there, both of them young, they both at the peak of their careers, you know, and it's, it's dope to date, you know what I'm saying? And uh, it seems like they, you know, was figuring out what they really wanted to do with the relationship, which every couple go through. I personally think that they probably made a good decision, whether it was uh, both of them saying, hey, we need to separate or, you know, either or. But what do y'all think? Leave a comment. Let me know what y'all think about that. Source also noted that there are no hard feelings between them and the decision was mutual. See? Let's just say that fans were having okay. a hard time believing the tight schedule excuse, with some speculating that Kendall was being pressured, especially by Kris Jenner, to take things to the next level. Remember how Kris said on the Ellen show that she wanted her next grandchild to come from Kendall? Well, I think it would be nice if it was Kendall, right? You think He's the only one who hasn't had a baby. Oh. And when Ellen asked if Kendall even wanted a baby, Chris responded, I think she would eventually love to have a baby. Yeah, eventually. Yeah. Uh, you know, hey, you know, we're in a different time. Everybody got different perspectives on when they should have kids. Yeah, man, as I was saying, man, it's obviously that everybody got their different, you know, perspectives on when they should have their kids or when they trying to have a kid, saying, and it, it really ain't no rush. Everybody got a different time frame on it. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Chris again pressured Kendall into having a baby, and Kendall was just like, You keep telling me you're not getting any younger, but guess what, Mom? What? It's my life. Hmm. Okay. Really? I don't know if I'm ready yet. <laughs> Apparently, Kendall still had a lot of reservations about taking that next step with Devin. Other than that, some people said that it's also possible that Kevin and Devin broke up because the family can be a bit pushy, and hmm. Devin didn't want to be smothered. As one fan pointed out, he's a handsome guy that doesn't want to be smothered. Kardashian have a habit of smothering their men. They can't even use the restroom alone. Hey, hey, you know, 
It's so it's so weird to even think that the world sees them as that type of woman. And it's like, there's so many different type of women out there. You know, women that like to, you know, be on their, their significant other. Some women that don't like to be on their significant other. You know, everybody got their own, you know, where they prefer to be with their uh, significant. Just, you know, thinking about this, it makes sense. And a man is successful, he's young, you know, and he got money, you know, and he don't want to end up like many other basketball players in a situation where they, they money took. Uh, you know, they got a baby from a woman and not a woman, you know, MIA. So I think that she actually wise. I actually like the fact that she like, yeah, you know, I'm going to wait. I'm going to push this off. This ain't no rush for me. You know, I'm going to take my time with this. And both of them, you know what I'm saying? I didn't even know they was dating, but that's dope. That's what's up. So Someone else also wrote, she just want a man, black, preferably, that she can showcase and parade around like a trophy at her celebrity events. And he probably just would like a girlfriend. And in response, someone gave another possible reason saying pretty sure she's gay well kendall has been accused several times of dating men to hide the fact that she's gay before so that wasn't surprising anyway there was also the allegation that devin was cheating on kevin and that's the reason why they broke up as soon as they broke up in june an insider who spoke to us weekly confirmed that the breakup took place just days after devin was spotted looking very single during a trip to scottsdale arizona in fact he was seen posing up to different women and being flirty throughout the night and after they broke up again one person wrote the fact that devin booker was allegedly cheating on kendall jenner every other weekend and they claim it's because of busy schedules is hilarious and don't you find it weird that the announcement that Kendall and Devin broke up was put out right after Harry Styles and Olivia Wilde broke up? Coincidentally, Kendall went to Harry's show right before his breakup was announced, fueling rumors that Harry and Kendall may have hooked up. We don't want to dig so much into that, but it's giving PR. Well, a Hollywood couple could be dated for way worse reasons, like the couple in this next video. Yo, that's the video, man. Hey, y'all be sure to check out all the other reaction videos I've done so far. Be sure to like, subscribe, turn on post notification because we on our way to 10K. I appreciate all my subscribers. And like I said, don't stop. See y'all next video. Question that they ask, but I'm spazzing on their ass in my phone. I'm going fast. Fuck your questions, I'm a boss. I used to take hella losses, now broke niggas keep your distance. I ain't got